right, first things first, it's locked. There's a panel with number keys. Will you push the keys? Yes. So this is the code that we use in that we found in the pool room in the tournament area. And that unlocks that door. Although from the looks of it you can just guess that anyway, because it's a little simple puzzle. And here it's locked. Plate say is double three. And the double door's locked as well. Just take my word for it. And that looked like a hornet's nest. But we found a dormitory key. Oh yep, yep, those are bees. We angered the bees. Not the bees. I don't even know what they are. Oh, double two. That was the other room, wasn't it? Oh god, shut noise. I didn't actually realise they made a noise. Oh. That, that just sounded like pure evil out of there. Are they actually in the remake? Because like I've not actually properly played the remake. Oh, there we go. We can use the key. All right, bye key. It was nice knowing you for however long you were here. Let's not get do anything with the gun yet. New territory. Let's go in here. Now, is this the one for the evil? It is. And that is a curse of death. I waste all the bullets, pal. That is a perfectly reasonable good idea. Right, you get up. That went better than it could have gone, I guess. And we have... Oh, I'm guessing that's number three. Is this number three? Where all the bees are? Indeed it is. Good to know. Alrighty-o then, alrighty-o, ooh, map. Yeah, empty. Ooh, desk is locked. We... Did I not pick up a key? Oh, I picked up the other key, right. I thought I had a small key on me for some reason. Dumpty sketch, will you take it? Sure. Hold on, what's that on the, what's that on the bed? I recognise this. Ah, the Plant 42 report. Let me just have a drink. Four days have passed since the accident, and the plant at point four two is growing amazingly fast. It has been affected by the tea forest differently than other plants have been, and shows unique shape in addition to its size. Looking at the way it behaves, it is now difficult to determine what kind of plant it was originally. There are two ways in which plant forty two gathers nutrition. The first one is through its root that reaches into the basement. Immediately after the accident, a scientist went mad and broke the water tank in the basement. Now the basement is filled with water. It is easily imagin imaginable that some chemical elements were blended in the water and promotes the incredibly fast growth of Plant 42. Another part of Plant 42 from the basement grows through the duct and hangs down like so many bulbs from the ceiling of the first floor. Many finds come out of those bulbs and they are the second resource for its nutrition. Once sensed in movement, Plant 42 shoots its vines around the prey and holds it. Then it starts sucking up blood, using the suckers located at the back of its vine. It also has some intelligence. It blocks the door by trimming its vines around it, especially when it captures prey or is sleeping. Several staff members have already fallen victim to this. May 21, 1998, Henry Sarton. The plant is smart, people. Okay? The plant has. It's very clever. 
And just for record, let's push all this out of the way to reveal a secret passage. I don't think we need to go down there, Chris. I'm not going to go down there. Not at the specific moment in time. Hmm. Tempted to use a herb. I'm also tempted to get the shotgun out. <laughs> I've got no ammo for my handgun. It scares me. Oh yeah, I think I'm... Wait, why am I going back and not picking up the damn herbs? I mean, I can only grab two of them, but still. Well, in fact, I could mix two of them up and then grab the third one. And that'll give me another sort of set of green heels. My brain does work. I do, I do like my brain. Sometimes. And then this is out of the way and I don't need to think about doing this later. Works for me. And green herb number two. And then mix up all the herbs. Not checking the herb out. I mean, how do we... How does this turn into like that little green stuff on the paper? What does Chris do with it? Angie for that record. Who knows? Who knows? A save station. I don't know why I just call this a save station, but who knows what I think. So I don't know what I think half the time. It just randomly enters my head and then leaves my head straight away after. Right, put these all away. I'll probably take another group set of green herbs with me. And of course, put this all away. I need, I need the blood book with me. Should be enough shotgun shells to last me for a while. I hope. I hope, otherwise I may be screwed a little later. And I don't really want to be screwed later. Just, just saying. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Why is Mario into my head again? I never know. Now, thankfully for the bees or hornets or wasps, whatever they are, they all decided to go back home into their little hive. Until you go over there again. Because apparently you disturbed them. And just for record, yes, this door is locked. I believe this is the door that the Plant 42 report was talking about. It won't move at all. It seems to be obstructed from the other side. Yep, Plant 42 is wide awake. And has blocked that door, so we can't go in through that door. And we just got rid of the key. So what is in this room? Who knows? I don't want to actually know if I heard a zombie or not. Oh, hello! Have a have a shotgun on me. I gladly take this clip though. Does clips inside the bath towel? Uh, what? Clips inside the bath towel is dirty. Okay, it's two sentences. Yes. Stop looking at the bath tub. Bath tub, Chris. Nothing major about this washstand, but. As always with Resident Evil, I'm impressed by the work on reflections in the mirror. That is great. So is one shotgun shell worth 15 bullets of a handgun? Probably not. Oh, there's definitely a zombie in here. Ha! <laughs> 
And there you go. Oh, I need I need two small keys. Okay. Now this looks like something that can move, but we can't move it. And also that close up of the bookcase looks look make makes make, make it important. Oh, so you notice here something stands out from all the red books. Oh, all red books. There's one white book. Will you take it? Of course. The Fijil Report. Weird. As I stated in the last report, there are some common features found in the cells of the plant infected by the tyrant virus. So that's the name of the tea in the tea virus. Blah, blah, blah. The tyrant virus. We also found another interesting fact through some experiments. We found an element that destroys these plant cells rapidly in UMB number 16. One of the series of UMB chemicals that we used for that experiment. We named this UMB number 16 as V-Gel. In our calculation, it would take less than 5 seconds to destroy plant 42 if we put the V-Gel directly on the root. You need to mix some of the UMB series chemicals in a specific order to create V-Gel. But the UMB series chemicals may generate a poison sketch which is harmful to the human body. Extreme caution should be taken when handling these chemicals. Following are the types of UMB series chemicals and their brief characteristics. Soft, soft, so it's silly white. So we've got UMB number 2 red, MP03 purple, UMB number 2, uh, number 4 green, Lelo 6 Lelo, no kidding, new number 7 liberal white, and number 13 blue, stimulating smell, and then of course you've got the feature which is brown. So we get to make that later, yay! Now a book is missing. Oh, isn't that handy that we got a book here then? Hey, secret passage! Let's uh, go through the door. Oh, hello, aren't you pretty? Welcome to Plant 42, everyone. Oh, Chris just watches it in amazement and grabs grabbed. Wait, that door's locked. What? Why's the door open all of a sudden? Chris! Rebecca. Thank you, really. Rebecca? It's no use. The roots of it are in the basement. You could. Whoa! Chris! Take this file with you. Use the information in it in order to make the potion and kill the root. Rebecca, please. Chris, don't die. And voila, Chris is now captured because he was an idiot. And if. Thank you, thank you, game. Rebecca, I like you opening doors. Uh, yeah, yes, thank you for telling me where the root of the problem is. Thanks. Also, grab the damn handgun, Rebecca. You should always have it out, no matter what. But yeah, we made that stuff now in here. And we actually do need to do this on this. Unless, of course, you'd have told Rebecca to stay in that one room. Yeah, she has the exact same amount of equipment as Chris, it seems. Six. So I think he's winning on the wall. One plus two is three. Three plus four is seven. Two plus four is six. Six plus seven is thirteen. And thirteen plus three makes sixteen. Why I said that like that, I don't know. Anyway, first things first. Let's grab the container that's up there, Rebecca. Don't know how she can reach up there because it's quite high up, but she can manage. She's a brave girl. We need all the containers, every single one. There should be four, three, three of them, I think, or four. No, there's four. Yeah, there we go. What does this say? 
Uh, water is one, red is two, purple is three, and green is four. Alright, I need to know that. Now, this is going to be a, while, a bit of a while of me going back and forth with the file that we got. Just for the last part of this, basically. Right, that's not the actual part I need. It's the, whoops, the text on the wall over here. So let's start from the beginning. 1 plus 2 equals 3. So we got uh, number 2 here. Let's grab number 2. I don't think we need the feed joke for, actually for this. Feed joke just basically talks about everything we in here. But like you can look at something here and it would say like UMB2 or UMB4 or something like that. And then this other note will actually tell you what the color, what number the colors are, so it's all good. Water is one, so we need one. We need some more then, and then we can mix those two up to make a third one. UMB number three. MP or three, in other words. So then what do we mix three with? What do we have? Three plus four. So we need to find a four. There's a number four. Put those two, get that into a container. And then we can mix these two up. And I think we can take a time regardless of Chris being sucked on by tentacles. UMB number seven. Now what's next? Two plus four equals six. And then mix six and seven up. Okay. So we grab a number two. And then we push over here and grab the number four. And then we mix those two up. There are six and number seven to make number 13. And then it's just three left, isn't it? Which is the two and one. Yep, 13 plus three. So let's grab another number two. And then we grab some water, mix those two up, and then get the mix the other two things up together to make a free joke. And that's how you make the free joke. Very simple puzzle. Infos a little maths, which is all spelled out for you. But there you go, number two with water, mp3 with 13, and it gives you the feature. So we have the feature, we're done in here, now we need to go into the basement, which I didn't do as Chris. I thought that door, by the way, was meant to stay locked for the plant when it's got its victim. I'm sure that's what the Plant 42 report said. And Chris just like walked straight into it, like, what the heck was he doing? I've cleared all this. There better not be any zombies down there. I'd be very unhappy if there were zombies. There's a ladder, will you descend it? I no, sure will. Ah, this creepy ass music. Right. Let's put you up to here. And then push you up against the wall. Now I won't push it all the way, but just some of the way. This will all make sense very shortly for you. Try and I'll try not to pick anything up as Rebecca. Oh, I think this may be one of my favourite tracks in the game. It's full creepy. So yeah, there's a little path here that we can't go in because the wall sails here. And Rebecca apparently can't swim. 
I don't, we don't even know what's in that water. Anything could be in that water. So we're basically pushing these boxes down into the water. But yeah, let's listen to this music. It's how creepy it is. That's why I'm playing this Rebecca. I'm playing this Rebecca. That's the only thing keeping me going here. That and she's, her inventory is just full of flipping containers. So she couldn't really pick much up anyway. Now, we should only need to do this one bit to the right here. Do, do. Sadly, it changes the music doing this. But wow, those are the roots. It looks like a plant root. So can we just use the free joke? Yes we can. Oh the sweet shiny in the corner. Is it in that bag or is it in the box? I can't tell. Where is it? I'm looking curious. There is no time to check it. Why? It's withered. So that thing's dead. So now we just need to go back to Chris. 